How's it folks in here back in Dishonored where we have rescued Emily. We have got shot at the Pendletons, or at least Slackjaw got rid of them for me because he's such a nice guy. But I am not quite ready to leave yet because I am missing a couple of runes. Now one of them I'm guessing is in the art place because I managed to steal into, I managed to get the code for his safe and you can apparently get into his building, except the door's locked, so I need to figure out how to get in there. But the other one... Ah! Okay, the other one is here. The other one is back at the Golden Cat. And I just didn't bloody pick it up on my way through, so how the hell did I get down to it? Because that... Yeah, you've got a prowler, it's me, shut up. Yeah, that looks like a hell of a drop even just for me. Let's figure out how the hell to get into this place. Let's just see what happens if I get another crack in this uh, that works so far. <coughs> awesome! Okay, where is it? Is that above my head? Alright then. Awesome! 4 out of 5. Now, how many more do I need? Essentially I want to change this bend time into stop time. Slowing down time doesn't really do too much. It helps when you're in a fight, but I don't really intend to fight that much, so... Stopping time, however... Sounds handy, and I need one more run before I can do it. Okay, so we have got all the runes out of this area, I am not going to bother with bone shards. They're handy, but they're really not that handy. How did I get in here and how the hell did I get back out? Let's try this way. Yeah, this was it. Oh, get up there. Well done. Okay, so now all I need to do is figure out how to get to the art dealer's place. There is a door. Let's do this first. Okay, there is a door at Griff's place where he sells you goods. But it's locked, so I don't know how to get into it. There is another one, however, I think, looking at the layout of the building, on that main street where I go oh, fuck off! Bloody rats. Oh shit, okay. All citizens, a mandatory whale oil ration is now in effect. Awesome, let's get the hell out here event. before I get seen. Somewhere high, please. Oh shit, 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 shit. Come on. I can't climb on that tree, can I? Ah, uh, damn it. Okay, let's see. Where is everyone? Oh, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. I can teleport behind that. Yes, I can. That'll do. Okay, we're safe ish. Yeah, so there is a door beside Griff, but it is locked and I do not know where to get the key. But on the main street where I kept getting into the doctor's office, there are similar doors on the- Oh, sh shit. Okay, this <laughs> is where that will come in handy. Let's slow down time and get the hell out of here. Did that get me up there? No it didn't. Shite, shite, shite. Jesus! Now we've got bloody weepers to deal with. 
Anyway, <laughs> that was fun. This is exactly where I want to go anyway, so I can't complain too much. I just need to figure it out. Who's shooting? Not him. Okay, that was weird. Yeah, okay, I just need to figure out how to get across this street now. Uh, I wonder if possessing that rat would get me somewhere. Okay, dude, can you take me across the road? There's a rat hole. Awesome, that works. Okay, so I'm at the right side of the street. Can we reach the lamppost? Yes! Do love the lampposts. Attention, Dunwall citizens. This district is now yeah, so you've got Dr. Govanis is over here. And this, I believe, is the same block as the... Oh, fuck, there you go. Yeah, that looks like the artist's place. <laughs> okay. Let's do it. Art dealer's apartment. Come on, Stu. One more try. They wouldn't have such a strong door unless they kept some interesting things on its other side. I'm told. It's fudge. Not even a bit. I think I bruised out my shoulder. Stop your crying. Really likes to just drop you in the shit sometimes, doesn't it? Okay. Yeah, I'll take that. Bone charms. Uh, no time for reading. Where are you going? No, no, no. Just... Oh, bloody hell, that's close. Right, where's he? Because he's staring this way. Oh fuck, he's kind of behind a pillar. Is it behind it enough? Shite, shite, shite! Oh, I just knocked something over. I just knocked something over. Are they both coming to investigate? Ah, <sighs> Jesus Christ, man. Okay. Be careful what you bump into in this goddamn game. What did I hit anyway? I'm not even sure. <laughs> right, you guys are not helping me out here. Come on, go somewhere bloody helpful, will ya? No, 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 no. No, okay. Right, what's your mate doing? He's standing right fucking there. Fuck it. Uh, okay. We need another way of doing this. I think I have one. Oh shit, he moved. Oh fuck! <laughs> Jesus Christ, that was bloody close. Okay then! <laughs> Best laid plans. I was hoping to slow down time, knock out one of them and just sleep or dart the other, but uh, yeah, that works just as well. 
Okay, we have a safe. What was the code? I don't remember. Shite. I don't remember. Notes. No, it's not going to be in there because it wasn't in a written note. Uh, objectives. Mission clues. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I was right at the top. I didn't even see it. Combination art dealer safe is 138. Awesome. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, that's a hell of a safe. And rune five of five. Awesome. Boil party invitation. Okay, and that didn't turn into cash and it didn't let me read it, so... Who knows? I have it now, anyway. Unbreakable door. Let's not put it to the test. I'll take that. That's cash. What else? Okay, let's hope there's no one nearby. I think we're good. And Curtis Morgan and the Postulate Child. <laughs> nice, I'll take those. Three energies. Awesome, okay. Well, we're not getting out of here just yet. I think we'll take a look downstairs and see what else is about. Might as well grab as much cash or whatevs as possible. Coming for me, or is he just coming this way? Where'd he spawn? Okay. Good night. Let's put you back here. Oh shit! You can get through there. Uh, where's where's his mate? Ah, it's just hanging about. Uh, bodies do make noise when you drop them, however, so... <sighs> Thankfully, didn't seem to notice. Now you just, that's it, you stand there, you have a smoke. Cheers, dude! Hope it was worth it. Sweet, okay. Now they're out of the road. Nice. Right ugly bastard, that's all I got. Now, what else can we do? Anything else we can grab? Nothing there. Doesn't look like it. Pretty damn empty, in fact. Fair enough. Next level. Oh, this St. Men went down here at least. It's a start. Ain't worth grabbing. Not so far. 
Although, yeah, I did. I did see food. Let's grab it, get our health back up. No, don't need any more of those. Okay. Art dealer's apartment key. Sweet. Although I'm in the art dealer's apartment. Oh, maybe it unlocks the back door. Maybe it unlocks the door. It'll take me out by Griff. That would certainly help. See, we get out that way. Right into the guards at the front. What's in here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Fucking ratty bastards. Get. They're gonna munch me. Up, 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 up. I said up. Son of a bitch! Oh Jesus, okay. Hi guys. Can I hit this? Doesn't appear that way. And there's nothing in here. Were you just supposed to scare the shit out of me and send me up towards the guards upstairs? Or the gangsters upstairs? I am not entirely sure what the point of that was. Anyway, is there a way out this way? Ah, downstairs. Cool. Unlock. Awesome. So yeah, I think this is the door that takes you out to Griff in that case, isn't it? Yes, it is. Nice. Alright, dude. How you doing? I've still not managed to grab your... Oh, <laughs> coins over here. Yeah. Sorry, dude. Want to look at some of the things I've found? Good prices, I swear. Yeah, what you got, man? What you got? Okay, do I need the lens magnification? I probably really don't. Bolts, bullets, rewire tools. Ah, you're fine, man. You've got nothing I really want. But cheers for the offer. Okay, I guess there's nothing left but to get the hell out of here. We have all five runes, which incidentally gives me the wrong button, which gives me eight, I believe. Yes, so now rather than slow time, we can stop it altogether, which will be really handy for times when I screw up and just land myself right in the middle of six guards like earlier on. That was stupid. Emily! Samuel! How you doing guys? Time to get the hell out of here. Alright Dal. I met your friend Samuel. He's going to show me how to steer this boat. Good stuff. Samuel. Are you both ready to go? Corvo, you must have worked wonders out there in the city tonight. I can't believe my old eyes. Nah, me neither did. Let's go. Let's get the go for this place. Okay, well, I got detected so I didn't get ghost, but everything else looks pretty damn decent to me. No alarms, no, no one dead. Yeah, you'll never see that ever again, trust me. <laughs> so you did the business, did you, Corvo? I'm not one to speak against my betters, Margaret, but if anybody ever deserved their fate, it was those Pendletons. What business are you talking about? Oh, I, uh, grown-up business, girl. I mean, your ladyship. Forgive me. It's okay. I heard a lot of grown-up business at the Golden Cat. Oh, I should concentrate on piloting this boat.
Young Lady Emily, I'm Callista. I'll be caring for you and schooling you while you're with us. Pleased to meet you. As am I. Would you like to see your room in the tower? Can I see it? Yes, you may. You'll get to see it all. The entirety of the Hound Pits. Good. I think I'll like it here. I'll go with Callista, Corvo. I'll see you later. No worries, doll. I'll catch up with you soon. You do not fail to impress. Armed with a blade, you've changed the course of the city forever. And with the Pendleton twins gone, our own Lord Pendleton will assume their votes in Parliament. In one night, you've done more than most men do in a lifetime. I need to speak to you soon. But for now, Lord Pendleton requests your attention. Yeah, no worries, big man. Any idea what? Well, well, okay, now I've got an idea where he is. Let's go and speak to him, and then I think we'll call it there. Oh, pops. Yes. All right, Chief, how you doing? Corvo, the Loyalist Conspiracy thanks you for your work. I don't know if I can. My own brothers. We never believed that you killed the Empress. It made much more sense that the Royal Spymaster, now the Lord Regent, was behind it, aided by some of his key allies. We spent a lot of money and exposed ourselves to great risk in getting you out of prison. But we did it because we believe that you're the one that can make the difference. Oh, and Havelock's looking for you. Okay, so I guess I'm not going to tell him. And it would make sense that I'm not going to tell him that we didn't actually kill these brothers. The question is... Is he going to hate me for it later on at some point? Or is that just... Part of dealing with the whole insurgency? Is that sacrifices get made? Who knows? I guess we'll find out as the game goes on. And I guess have a look wants to tell me whatever the hell I'm going to be going to do next. However, I think we'll do that in the next episode. So, as always, if you enjoyed this episode, please hit like, hit subscribe, feel free to leave any comments below. And until next time, take care folks.